Paula Jeske, and this is my mock, The Lost World. Um, we can start off with the gas station. I like how I did the gas pumps, how um, they're kind of broken off. And I added a lot of dogs around the mock. I didn't do much interiors for designing, but in this building, I did some. I'll show you guys. And right up here, you have a sniper because there's supposedly like a war going on. And he has a, pretty sure I got this from Eclipse Brick. It's supposed to be like a peanut butter cup right. and a chocolate. Some of those cool yeah. printed tiles, yeah. And right down here, it's a toy store. It has an Iron Man helmet, whoops, right here. And then you can see all the le overgrown leaves on there, then a tent with some water bottles up there. Then there's a guy hiding behind the roadblocks. Um, then there's a car, another road, more road, roadblocks. There's some people fighting right here. Then there's this building. Um, I just put some figures up there, the Brick World figure and some Game of Thrones. Should I show you the interior? Or? Sure, yeah, that'd be awesome. Yeah, this is... So this up here is supposed to be like a cafe, as you can see. You can see the boarded up windows and the and like all the cooking stuff in there mm -hmm. then that's like my only interior for this mock just because it takes a lot of time yeah there's so much so much detail on the exterior that it's hard to always include all that stuff on the inside then this is a destroyed car that got hit by a mortar and you can see there's a skeleton in there this is a brick mania mortar right there I didn't set it up though. Then a destroyed building. Uh, and then some more figures fighting. Then right here you have a tree that's overgrown and started going to the into the windows. I made it go up here, but I didn't really like that style, so I just covered it up. I like what you've done with the windows here, kind of giving that Thank broken you, glass yeah. effect. I looked up that technique online and it was cool. Then Right here you have a school bus. There's just an alien in it for fun. Then you have a custom like military truck um, with the Indiana Jones tent on the back. There's nothing inside though. Then you have some barricades for people to go behind. And uh, something I did it's because I used so many tiles for this. I used the bricks like this and just slid them in like that. Okay. Like over there too. So some of it's not necessarily attached, just kind of set on there yeah. to create a cool effect. Like some of these. Then here's some guns in there. Then you have like this big building. This is probably took me the longest because it kept on falling apart. I finally got that. It's uh, like destroyed. You can see all the inside. And that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for. No, thank everything. you. It's a great layout. So, is, is there kind of a larger story you made up of kind of what's going on here? It looks like you've got some guys fighting. Um, yeah, like just war because supplies are limited in this type of, um, this type of world. So. Okay, so they're all fighting over the supplies. I like yeah. that. So you, obviously you've got a lot of these very torn down type of buildings. What do you find are the difficulties when trying to build that, that type of design? Um, I actually did a design on the back. I'll turn this around. In the back I didn't add much detail, but I like this design I used to show like the interior. And it was kind of tricky to get it. Um, then there's like an owl's nest right here, slid off. Then I put some more toys right here. And this design I, for like the uh, shutters and stuff, um, I just put Technic piece pins in there. Yeah. And yeah, and some other designs I did like a little, um, what's it called? Alleyway yeah, sort alleyway, of? alleyway and there's a cat back there. And some other designs, the boarded up windows, and for the gas station, broken glass down there.
That always adds a really cool effect yeah. to this kind of this kind of building with the rundown look. Yep. Well, very impressive. Yeah, thanks so much for taking us through your display here. Appreciate it. All right, thank you guys.